Three Kings Day is really special for me. For Puerto Rican kids who grew up in New York, it's like this extra holiday. I don't know how aware you are of this tradition, but this is the way we celebrate it as a family. The day before, on January 5th, I'd go out to the park near my house with my dad, and we would go collect grass and hay for the camels of the Three Kings. You get enough to fill a shoebox, and you put it next to your bed. Just like you would leave milk and cookies for Santa, we're leaving grass and hay for the camels to eat, because they've obviously come a very long way if they're coming to upper Manhattan to bring you toys. And you go to sleep, and you wake up, and there's, first of all, there's presents at the foot of your bed. Second of all, there's grass and hay all over your house. So your brain is filled with the mental images of, oh my goodness, there were camels in my house, and they traipsed up the stairs, and they ate the hay next to my bed. And it's, and it's this incredible Three Kings Day miracle. Now here's the thing. If you're growing up in New York, you gotta go to school that day. But you get to go to school with your new toys. I went to a school with not a lot of other Latino kids. It was me, Jillian Mojica, Jaman Martinez, and Pacho Velez. I still know all their names because there was only the four of us. And we had this like little secret. We had our secret little extra holiday. There are thousands of kids in Puerto Rico whose parents have been worrying about basic survival these past three months. I've partnered with Toys R Us, Telemundo, and Revolución Latina to collect hopefully over 10,000 toys for kids this holiday season. So let's go above and beyond and be the Santa Claus and Three Kings they need this Christmas and Three Kings Day. Thanks again and happy holidays.